welcome to day 3 of my vlog in Rome okay, So today we are going to Spanish Steps, Travi Fountain and Mars So stay tuned So right now we have arrived at Travi Fountain It's so nice but it's uh, a little bit cold over here uh, We took some photos already uh, just before the crowd comes Oh my god, so pretty right? It's so bright, clean and pure so normally what people will do is people will throw their coin inside that pool and I would recommend you to come at about 7, 7.30 because the crowd is like this only There's not many people here yet so you have to come early uh, because if you come later, the place will be packed and you can't get your shot Okay guys, so right now we are at the Pantheon which used to be a temple but right now it's a church so it's really really huge and it's really good because there's literally no one here I mean got <laughs> one or two Then there's horsey Oh my god he's neighing Yeah so come early guys Come early you, know, you can't get like perfect shot Guys if you can see the pillar The pillar is so damn huge And like Oh my god And look at the door Oh my god It's like those like metal kind And if you can see right It's like really like greenish color okay guys so right now we are gonna have our proper breakfast at mcdonald's um so there's a mcdonald's really close to the pantheon which is about five minutes away so we are ordering right now okay guys so we gotten our order we ordered three burger and one fries um the reason why we are so good out is because the service here is really sucky we waited 30 minutes for fast food and on top of that they didn't wear their gloves to compare the food which is really really gross and really really disgusting i hope mcdonald's will take uh, some action when this video goes up so we got some fries and some crispy bacon so some uh, crispy burger bacon okay guys so after the sake experience at mcdonald's right now we are at piazza navona we, she is really really close to our McDonald's about one minute away So basically Piazza Novana is a square where you can play games, shopping Yeah, so I'll show you what it looks like So you can see this at the entrance of Piazza Novona And let's go At the side over here you can see like there are small small restaurants and you can see a carousel over there something nice about the fountains in Rome is that there are a lot of statues around it like this guy over here and this guy over here <laughs> right now we are at Largo di Torre Argentina don't know whether I say it right um, this place is where Julius Caesar got assassinated so um, everybody wanted to bring him down because um, they wanted his throne You only can see it from like up here So right now we are at Bartolucci Which is a Pinocchio inspired shop It's like everything wooden And yeah, let's go in Look at it Like the motorcycle is even wooden So cool I'm not sure whether I can film But let's go in So let me show you some of the souvenirs that we can find here Look at all these, it's so cute These are pencil holders yeah. So right now we are at Gioletti which is the oldest gelato shop in Italy and you can either sit to have it here or take away but we are taking it away because I think that one you have to order their pastries and stuff like that it's really really fancy inside so I'll show you what I got so what I'm having here is banana and also oh, nougat right. I love both flavors in general so I'm really excited to try how it tastes like and this white thing on top here is cream got it for three euros God, it's so good. Mm. 
Okay guys, so um, I'm not sure where I stopped. Oh, I think my, it must be the Gioletti. After that, we wanted to go to Zara and also Sephora. Um, Zara was closed, uh, but Sephora was open, but I didn't film because it's just basically like any other Sephora. So after that, we went to Spanish Steps because we wanted to take some pictures, but it was packed with people. Like, all you can see is the people, it's not the steps. So right now, we are doing our grocery shopping again. Actually, I'm so amazed of all the Kinder stuff because they got so many Kinder snacks. Ooh. I will show you if there are things that are different that I've never seen before, like this. This is the Kellogg granola with bits of chocolate. It looks so good. And this too. Okay, so this is what we got. We got three small pizza which cost 250 euros each. And this one is a mushroom and white cream. This one is salami. And this is spinach, spinach and meat. Mm, spinach and meat. And Michelle also got this mixed vegetable. Yum, yum, yum. So I'm gonna try this salami one. This must be three, four, five, five euros. How can we go? It's so good. It's like thin. Mmm. It's delicious. And it's cheap. <laughs> Pizza is really delicious until you look at my sister. Empty. Within minutes. So guess what? We are going to buy. Round. <laughs> Other than buying pizza, we are basically done for the day. We will have to get ready and pack for tomorrow because tomorrow we are taking the train to Florence and we'll be staying there for about 3 days. So make sure to stay tuned for the rest of the vlog. And also if you enjoyed this vlog, please click the subscribe button below and give this video a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!